Hello, thank you for your interest in Air Job Boss Professional Pilot Interview Preparation. My name is Blaine Dapper. I'm a professional pilot myself, and I started Air Job Boss to help other pilots prepare themselves for the interviews of their lifetime. Now, this all started with my YouTube channel and my video content because I saw that there wasn't that much free information out there and I wanted to provide people with a lot of general information and some specific information so that they can prepare themselves for their interview. But I felt that really, as I did when I was beginning my interview process, that professional one-on-one -on -one preparation is probably best case scenario to ensure that you achieve this objective of getting this very important job. And if you're viewing this, video you may have an interview coming up soon or you're very close to achieving an interview and you're wondering do i need professional one-on-one -on -one preparation and what does that include and why should i use a specific company whether it be air job boss or some other company the first question is do you need professional preparation for your interview now, uh, it's obvious that you don't interview on a daily basis and you are not in touch with the human resources department on a daily basis. So it, it lends itself natural progression that you're probably not great at interviewing. So you are wise to prepare yourself. I have talked to human resources departments that say that they can tell if somebody is not prepared and in some cases on paper they looked well qualified but the methods under which they were trying to express themselves were not adequate to offer them the job. Currently in 2020, uh, 2022 about 80% of applicants are getting hired. Many do not have professional preparation. On the other hand, 20% do not get a job offer. and We don't really know how many are receiving professional preparation or not. But a question that's often asked when you go into the airline interview is, how did you prepare for this interview? So this is the answer to the question of, do I need professional preparation before I go into an interview? The, the, the answer is another question. Do you need this job? Do you need the job you're interviewing for? When you consider, if this is a major airline, when you consider your total career compensation is in the multiple million dollars, paying a professional preparing uh, company to prepare you is, is a very, very small fee associated with it. And not only that, the, the, the information that you learn from Air Job Boss during the preparation can be used at multiple and any airline. Once I get with you and, you and I teach you the techniques that, air, that I have developed, you can apply this to any of the airlines that you may interview at. But the question is, how bad do you want this particular job? Hopefully, this is your number one pick. Hopefully, you're getting the interview at an airline you really want to work for. I have got hired. My first interview, I failed. It was the, the airline that I wanted to work for the most and I failed it. Since then, I've been hired at six other airlines, and I'm currently an employee at a major airline. I'm a captain at a major airline. So it all worked out well, but the first time, guess what? I didn't prepare myself properly. The second time, I got myself prepared. So that is my history, and that's why I created Air Job Boss, and specifically one-on-one -on -one preparation. Because one, there's a process that's associated with this preparation that needs one-on-one -on -one case because your experience, your talents, and your skills are unique. Your background is unique and you need a counselor to formulate your experience with the culture of that airline and meld those two together so that when you're expressing yourself in an interview, they see that you're a good corporate fit, that you're a match. So let's, my qualifications, my qualifications are this, and, and, and as, as the extension of Air Job Boss, I have been in the major airline business for 25 years. I have worked in, I have been educated in an airline university. I've been a flight instructor, charter pilot. I was working in a regional airline, an international cargo airline, a major U.S. airline. I have worked for foreign airlines. I have been a flight instructor, a line check airman, a sim instructor, a chief pilot. I have assisted in the hiring of hundreds of foreign pilots for foreign companies. And I currently 
keep in contact with many of the human resources organizations at all the major airlines in the United States. If I cannot help you, I will tell you I cannot help you. So you're always will, uh, able to contact me prior to purchasing any of my products at info at airjobboss.com. This is my address, my email address, and you can contact me with any questions. But here is the process of air, my, my process for preparing you. The first, the first step is me sending you the airline's profile and interview preparation information. Now this is a PDF file and it has the airline's profile, general information about the airline, specifically the airline's mission statements, their core culture, um, if they have core culture, uh, certainly their mission statement, their operational safety policy to give you an idea of really what they're trying to accomplish as an airline and what you'll need to know about them to match your personality with their corporate culture. So also in that PDF package is, of course, the interview process, what you can expect, and the questions that you're likely to get on those interviews. Second phase is me having a one-on-one -on -one conversation with you on the phone, getting to know you. I need to know your experience, your background, um, any negatives you have, and this is a matter of going through your application process, reviewing your resume, so that I can understand you as a person and better than they know you, because they know you, of course, by the application, but I need to know you more because we need to come up with proper answers that match and hit target uh, demographic for them to evaluate you in a positive scenario. And knowing the way they're gonna evaluate you is a very key important part. So number one is our paper packet. Number two is a one hour conversation over the phone, me getting to know you, you getting to know me. The third component is a second phone call, one hour phone call, where after you have the written material, and I know something about you, and I'll have you look over that written material in a very specific way, and during the second conversation, we'll go through and we'll, have, we'll strategize about how to formulate specific answers, general targets, the theme of your approach, and techniques you're gonna be using in the interview environment to make them believe that you already basically work there. That's what we want. We want them to look at you as if somebody, you're already one of their finest employees and you already work there, okay? The final stage is a two-hour video conferencing call where we do a mock interview. You will be dressed and prepared for your interview. I will come on the video conferencing with you and we will go over a mock interview of one hour in duration. Most airline interviews are between 30 minutes and an hour, maybe 45 minutes. So that is, this is quite extensive amount of time, probably cover about 10 to 12 to 13 questions. The second hour is gonna be critiquing and kind of brushing up on those answers. And about that time, you will be kind of peaked, right ready to go into that interview. Won't be perfect, but it'll be close, and you'll have a little bit to think about, but I think you'll come out quite confident at the end of that video conferencing after this process and feel well prepared and confident going in there and you will be able to put your best foot forward and have the greatest chance of success. All you need is a chance. They're offering you this chance to come in an interview. They've called you, they've invited you and they want you to work there. The main thing is don't give them any reason to not hire you and give them every reason to consider you somebody that they've already hired. Again, if you have any questions about my program, contact me at info at airjobboss.com and I'll be happy to answer any questions. Thank you so much. I look forward to working with you soon.